Hello, I'm Scott Flowers with Cloud Ninjas. And today we're here to learn how to update the BIOS on your Dell PowerEdge R640 server. Links for stopping by today, guys. Please hit the like button and don't forget to smash the subscribe. Well, let's go ahead and uh, get started. First thing I wanted to preface it is uh, for the method that we're going to be showing you today, you need to have an OS on your server so that way you can access um, an internet browser. Uh, we're going to be doing this with Internet Explorer. There's some options that, uh, as we get uh, further in the video, might be slightly different if you're using Chrome or Firefox, but uh, all stuff that would be very easy to, uh, to understand. So this is going to have the heart of everything you need to do. Uh, so we'll go ahead and get rolling. So uh, first things first, you're going to go into your web browser. As I said, we're using Internet Explorer. You're going to click uh, Dell.com. When Dell pops up, you're going to go to their support tab under their support tab there's a view all support click that you will see to the right search support simply type in r640 you'll see an option pop up for power edge r640 all pretty simple now you're going to go to drivers and downloads when it pops up you'll see the operating systems tab you're going to want to go to bios same thing for the category tab you're going to want to go to bios once both of those are selected to BIOS, just scroll down. It'll tell you the uh, current version and when it was released. Hit download, hit save. Uh, once this is done, you will go ahead and click view downloads. Once you hit the view downloads, this screen will appear. Double click the BIOS and click install. Uh, once the install goes through, it'll give you a warning sign and tell you the version that you're going to. Go ahead and click yes to update to the latest version. Um, after you're done, uh, this is you know, doing the uh, process of actually getting everything going, but to actually finish the install, you're going to have to uh, restart your system. Uh, it'll give you an option here in a second to restart it or to go ahead and uh, continue with what you're doing. If you continue with what you're doing, go ahead and you know close out whatever else you have going on and then go ahead and uh, close, uh, hit the restart, but that's it. You're done. You've officially updated the BIOS on your R640 server. If you have any questions, uh, please feel free to reach out to sales at cloudninjas.com. That's sales at cloudninjas.com. And thanks for stopping by. Have a great day.